Yo, what is happening people? Manga Sloth here. Today we got a nice, quick, easy, breezy, beautiful DBZ cover box set coming at ya. And it is used. It is a used manga box set. It is not brand new. So I want to ask you all before we begin, let me know down below in the comments, do you buy used manga? Would you buy a manga that was beaten, broken, ripped, damaged if it was cheap enough? Let me know how cheap it's got to go before you decide to buy or if you would even buy it at all. So we got a used Dragon Ball box set. Now I have been in the market for one of these for a while, but it hasn't been the biggest priority on my list to get one of these. I think so far the cheapest I ever seen one was maybe, I don't know, 130 bucks or something around that area, 120, 130, and that's brand new. But this one I got used And I am happy about it. And why am I happy? Because number one, I didn't need a brand new one. And number two, it was so cheap. I got this box set for $40 used. So let's take a look at it right here and let's get into it. Classic Dragon Ball. We all remember watching this growing up. At least I do. We got Piccolo here, personal favorite. And then we got the gang. There we go, Goku, young Goku. So right off the bat, I can see right here we got a little bit of corner damage, like it's been thumped or bumped into. But besides that, I am not seeing much of any damage whatsoever. So let's crack this puppy open and let's see how the stuff inside looks. All right, there we go. Dragon Ball 1 through 16 and it looks like even buying used I got the extra stuff in there so let's take a peek at these from what I can see the spines top and bottom I'm not seeing any rips dings dents scratches so I think the books are near mint here so that is a bargain and I would pay $40 for all 16 of these without the box set obviously also. Let's pop these suckers out. This red just pops and this is just a classic, classic looking series. And I really like, I like the way they look and I like how there's no background. Not every manga can pull this off or series. Uh, a lot of them do do this square type deal and different variations and and I think it I think it looks all right but I really like the picture just on a solid red manga and they just fill it out nicely so I'm just showing you all the covers here giving you an idea of what they look like all up close got all this classic Dragon Ball imagery coming at you nostalgia all up in this and we'll even open one here. Let's see, we'll open number 15. Oh yeah, looks good. Super excited to have this in my collection. And it's been a while, and it's been a while since I've been wanting to pick these up. If you remember, I did pick up the Dragon Ball Z box set finally. It was a long time. And we got this little book here, and we even got the poster. So I was wondering if it was coming with these, you know, I was half expecting that these might not be in there. And there you go, we got the spines lining up like DBZ does. I wish more people would do similar things to this, or even if they connect it, I love that kind of stuff. Well, there you have it. There is the Dragon Ball Complete Box Set, $40. Keep your eyes open for deals. I say it all the time. They are out there. I'm looking almost constantly, and I still don't find any uh, every week, every month. This one, I, I haven't had a deal in months, and I found this one and the only damage I see is this corner here which I will take all day every day. Let me know down below what you would buy and how much damage you would take on a manga and would you buy this Dragon Ball box set for $40 or would you say nah dog get out of here. Thanks for watching I'll see you all next time.